So here's the Quest canopy setup that I'm going to use to make a cover to go over the rear doors of the van so we can leave the doors open and protected from the rain. So the first thing I'm going to do is cut the floor right down the center all the way to the back and then to the sides. And the reason is I'm going to use that floor to fold it up against the sides here and attach it to the poles so it's going to cover up that netted area so it's going to waterproof that netted area. The maximum stretched out opening at the base measures about 80 inches. The max opening here at the top measures 56 inches. So a tiny bit small for the back doors that are about 60 inches, but I think it'll work. 54 inches in the back here. So this is my attachment mechanism and you'll have to adjust this depending on how your van is made, which model it is. But um, I'm using these already integrated loops down here, some paracord and going up to these kind of hooks that are up here that uh, are for the door closing alignment and just attaching onto those. It's a tent line adjustment knot here so I can adjust the tension on this. And I can kind of raise and lower the back. I may need to put something to hold it downwards to. I and mean, that could just be attached down to the bottom of the door. I will need a cross brace between these doors to really keep them open properly because there's just a soft stop here. There's not a lockout on there. So a cross brace will be good. Same over here, I have this adjustable tent tie down line. Going up to the hooks up here. For the roof, you'll have to improvise the attachment. You could come down to the sides, maybe use like some sandbags on the sides. In this case, I have a roof rack and these solar panel mounts. So I'm just attaching a cord to the poles. It's passing over the solar panel bracket, under here, over to the end of the door, and then adjustable in length again to adjust the tension. And this just makes it easier to attach and adjust the tension than having to mess with something that's on the roof. Same thing over here on this side. This keeps it down really well. So another idea I had is to attach a line on there and then you could pull that forward and maybe like attach a sandbag to it. You could also add magnets to this fabric to keep the fabric tight against the surface or like against the roof. I like the fact that this thing has pop-out sides because it keeps everything in tension and it keeps it nicely up against the van without having to attach anything and it's not, there's no flapping there. There's no need to cut off the bottom section. It's easy enough to duck under this. In fact, this would make a great start to add a privacy curtain here and then you could do like your outdoor shower or changing room outside, rinsing off, etc. Taking it down is simple enough. You just untie the lines, and then just lift the whole thing off. Set it down on the ground, and then pop everything in.